Hello, and welcome to another Hexton tutorial. Today we're looking at Translate My Store, also known as TMS for short. But more specifically, we're going to be looking at manual translation. This can be found on the dashboard right here, or on the sidebar right here. Let's jump in. We're going to be using our Find by Category filters. So first let's select a language. Let's pick German. Here we can see all of our different translation categories. And we can also see how much each category is translated. We have options for translating or syncing each category. So for example, if you update any of your products, you can click sync and TMS will get all of the latest text from this category. So let's click translate on collection. Here we can see we automatically loaded the German language, the category collections, and the translation status is all. So this is gonna show all of our collections and the translations into German. We can also just load our collection elements that are not translated at all. So if we load, and we could see this is the only element in our collections that is not translated. But let's go back to all. And here we could see this collection only has the title. But if we go down, we could see that our new pants collection has the title, the body, the meta title, and the meta description. If you have many different collections, you can search here, let's say glass, and there we go. And we also had different categories. So let's look at our online store theme. For our online store, we don't have any different collections or products, but we do have subcategories. So maybe everything about our customers you want to translate, you can do that here. And there's also different translation categories, such as the cart page, that doesn't have any subcategories at all. Just all of the elements for the cart page. Now we're going to do a translation example on our collections, and we're going to translate this daily deals collection title. But first, let's check it out on our store. So here we can see all of our different collections on our store. And we're still on English, so let's change this to German. And here we can see all of our collection titles have changed because they've all been translated before, except for our daily deals. So let's go ahead and translate that. All we have to do is put in our translation right here and save the changes. It's as easy as that. And we can see all of our translation tasks in our view tasks page. Here we can see I just translated one item, the manual task type, and we translated from English to German. We can see the details, our original text, our old translation, and our new translation. So let's check it out on our store. Refresh the page. And there we go, we can see our daily deals translation here at the bottom. Well, that's just about everything you need to know for translating with manual translation. Thank you very much for watching, and please let us know if you have any questions.